The New Orleans Sewage and Water Board is the focus of corruption investigations, this time at the height of the election season. Well, that's the topic of this week's commentary by Eyewitness News political analyst and Gambit columnist Clancy Dubos. Four years ago, mayoral candidate Latoya Cantrell promised to make fixing the Sewage and Water Board her top priority. After last week's FBI raid of the SNWB, which came hours after Eyewitness News investigator David Hammer's expose of self-dealing at the agency, it's clear not much has changed. Hammer revealed insider deals among plumbing inspectors, gas inspectors, and contractors using each other's licenses to get permits and then inspecting each other's jobs. The feds moved in quickly because records in the plumbing department are literally on paper and index cards, a problem noted previously by city and state investigators. Everyone knows the SNWB is antiquated and dysfunctional. Now we can add corrupt to that list of descriptions. What we don't yet know is if, when, and how things will ever change. This has been an expression of opinion by Clancy Dubose. Email your thoughts to commentary at WWLTV.com.